what is going on my good people terror squad what's going on welcome back to the channel all right welcome back we are here with the finals well not the final season why, why am i saying final season three of one of the most confusing shows ever the most confusing comprehensive story <laughs> It's a weird dynamic with the show because as soon as you think you figured it out, they throw 10 other possibilities at you. And to be honest, that is what I love about this show. I love the fact that it keeps you out of the loop while keeping you in the loop. Um, so... We're not going to waste too much time on my intro here because I just really want to jump in and react. I want to do two episodes tonight before my bedtime, you know, and I'm really looking forward to see what they're going to do here. I don't know when season four is coming out as if it has dropped already. I don't know. I'm not checking for it or anything. As with shows like this, I don't want to be spoiled about anything, so I don't research anything. So until I'm caught up with the show, and then you guys, of course, you're gonna, I'm pretty sure you guys are going to update me on what's going on. What is the current situation with season four? If it's out, if it's not out, whatever. Okay? And don't forget, guys, if you want. To see these episodes of whether it's dark, whether whatever it is, consider joining the membership on the on the YouTube channel. Of course, really do appreciate all everybody that comes in. Sign up for early access. It's only two dollars in the U.S. Only two dollars, a dollar ninety nine, um, to sign up for early access. I made sure to make it reasonable so that you guys can join, and it's not hurting anyone's pockets okay but hey if you can't do it and you can wait around for a while you can do that too you know you can wait a week for these episodes to drop i really do need to get consistent with my early access content i know that but there's a bunch of interruptions that keeps happening um, because of my girl being sick and stuff like that and now is that time when she while she's recovering regular doctor visits and stuff like that to make sure that she's okay making sure that her head is okay and those are the things that i'm dealing with why i haven't really been reacting because if you remember everything was flowing nicely y'all had plenty of stuff to watch during the week whether it be tv shows whether it be anime but then kind of things kind of slow down and that's what's been happening and i've already talked about it on the channel and tell you guys what's going on um so there's stuff that i get planned sometimes and then things just happen right so i'm hoping that things will change for the better um in the upcoming weeks of course once everything is settled again we are heading into the holiday season so i'm looking forward to that but in any case guys let's jump into these reactions and see what they have for us we know that martha showed up at the end of season three to save Jonas. i don't know how why we just literally in the same episode watched her die and she showed up the same age i don't know if she she kind of looks older so let's not say it's the same age but she does kind of look older so i don't know i don't want to sit here and make it seem and my green screen is not in the place it's supposed to be i need to fix it but yes so let's get that done and i will see you guys for the review all right guys welcome back to the after show the after episode review get this out of the way that was brilliantly done as always beautiful um, season opener 
um, beautiful second episode these two episodes were good and your boy terabyte reacts still don't know what the hell is going on as i said before if you can explain to me what's going on in the show after uh, you can connect the dots and figure out what the end game is for this series that's probably something i'm going to do for the upcoming seasons like when they announce the final season that's probably something i'm going to do like as in for like the um we know it's the final season so i'll put out a poll of you know and i'll take a, a take notes of who would guess the ending of how the ending of dark will be and whoever gets it right wins something you know what i'm saying like i'll probably do something like that i just have to remember to do it wow so as i said my reviews for dark is just basically going to be r rambling it's it's just that's what it is that's pretty much what my reviews have always been for dark because i don't know what to talk about at the end of the episode especially if it's in the middle of the season i really don't know what to come here as a review and talk about other than well things look great for season three <laughs> things look awesome so far um but storyline wise what am i supposed to talk about you get what i'm saying the only thing i can say really is that okay we see that the cycle of things going on and on and on and it seems like nothing has really changed but now we know that there's a separate world that it seems like Jonas created a separate world i don't know if he created it or it existed this whole time or he just created a world without himself to see if he can stop the cycle but it didn't you get what i'm saying but the people who are in 2019 of that world they're older than the people that we've come to know in season one and two they're different they're different they're older than them right so it it just creates more complications for the storyline but it's still so good because you still want to know what's causing all of this you still want to know if everybody going to be safe at safe at the end you still want to know if Jonas is going to figure out what what the origin of everything is and solve it we're all waiting for this to happen for them to figure it out but every time you think they figure it out something else just pops up and completely destroys your expectations you get what I'm saying so that's where we're at in the series it doesn't take anything away from it because it's still so good the mystery they'll give you you know a little breadcrumb here or there and here and there but you still can't put really anything together because you know nothing really fits together it's like a jigsaw puzzle that can never be solved that's how i feel watching the show it's like it's a jigsaw puzzle that will never get solved you know what i'm saying and we know that all jigsaw puzzles you know what i'm saying it can be solved it's like we have this jigsaw puzzle and it's not as if a, a piece or two is missing the pieces are all there you just can't put it together because every time you put it together and you have a complete piece you get what i'm saying it's like your little kid brother or sister just comes and just <laughs> and just mess everything up again that's how you feel watching the show so it's kind of like how are you ever going to figure out what's really going on in this show is yet to be known i love the fact that this show really really commands your attention you know what i'm saying like you have to pay attention i know i've probably missed so many hints and clues already which maybe people who have watched the series over two or three times are catching on to now you know what i'm saying but 
I don't know, maybe after the series is finished, I'll go back and watch certain things or I'll watch some videos explaining the hints and the little things that we missed in season one and two and three and whatever as we go along. And as I've told you guys, as soon as I catch up to season three and I tell you guys, you can send, you can send, start sending the videos now. I don't have no problem. I'll, I'll just have them saved. I'll bookmark them. So I'll watch them and I'll react to them after season three. If I know that YouTubers out there have their theories and conspiracies, you know what I'm saying? It's kind of like with Game of Thrones where you had all these theories and stuff of how the series is going to end and stuff like that. I'm pretty sure Dark has that kind of fandom that you know somebody's out here doing videos watching the series watching the episodes over and over again to find little clues as to how this series will end or where they're going with the series introducing this new world a new dimension if you will of people coexisting you know they're doppelgangers you get what i'm saying because this is not a new timeline like they didn't travel back in the past or into the future this is a whole different world they exist in this world just the same, just that Jonas is the only one that doesn't exist in this world. So I don't know. I don't know what to think. I don't know how to tell you guys. I don't know what to tell you guys, because as I said, speculation or no speculation, you're probably going to be wrong. So why even go there? But anyways, thank you guys so much for tuning in. As always, man, I appreciate y'all for sticking with me throughout this series i know i've been lacking i'm trying to finish up this season um so that i can move on to another series or at least try to catch up with some sons of anarchy and then i'll move on i want to open up with two new series after i catch up with dark for early access so i'm just trying to get through dark first so Thank you guys so much. Hope you guys appreciate it, man. Let me know what you think of these two episodes. The first time you watched it in the comment section, of course. Leave a like on the video. And your boy will catch you later. Peace.